In this video, I'll show you how to use the word no in front of a noun in order to make a negative. In this sentence, we have some milk. The verb is affirmative. To make it negative, this is in the present tense, have becomes don't have. We don't have. Some becomes any because of the negative. Milk. We don't have any milk. Or you can say we have no milk. No makes the verb and the noun following it negative. We don't have any milk is the same as saying we have no milk. Sometimes a sentence like this is stronger than a sentence like this. So I could say it like this. We don't have any milk or we have no milk. Here are some more examples. I have some money. I don't have any money. Or I have no money. Notice the difference between not and no. If you said I have not money, that would sound kind of strange. I have no money. There is some paper in the machine. This might be a photocopier. Or you can say, there isn't any paper in the machine. Or you can say, there is no paper in the machine. In this example, someone goes on vacation to a place where there aren't any people and says, when we went on vacation, we saw no one, we called no one, we watched no TV, we had no problems. Students weren't allowed in the room. You can start the sentence by saying, no students and then change this to were no students were allowed in the room there's a very popular expression in English that goes like this no man is an island not one person can do things by himself or herself. A person needs help from other people. No man is an island. 